Hello everyone. Today we're going to take a quick walk around look at this 2012 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland. This Grand Cherokee is in stone white clear coat. It has a dark and light frost beige premium leather interior. This vehicle is four wheel drive with a Quadra Track 2 four wheel drive system and the select train controller. It is powered by a 5.7 liter Hemi V8 engine with a 6 speed 65 RFE auto stick automatic transmission. This vehicle does have the Park View backup camera with the Park Sense rear parking sensors, trailer tow group, dual bright tipped exhaust uh, caps. Does have the Quadra Lift air suspension. 20 inch painted aluminum wheels on Goodyear Forterra HL tires. Does have the Command View dual pane panorama sunroof. Keyless enter and go smart key access. Blind spot monitoring with cross path detection and adaptive cruise control. And up front, we have automatic projector beam, xenon high intensity discharge headlamps and fog lamps. All right, and this vehicle is equipped with a remote start. To operate is easy, just double press the remote start button on the key fob. And to utilize keyless enter and go is easy just by keeping the key fob in your purse or pocket. Simply approach the vehicle and to lock the vehicle, locate the chrome button on the door handle. Horn will chirp in the vehicle will lock. To unlock, just simply grab the handles, you would open it. The vehicle will unlock. All right, and inside, we have power heated, automatic dimming rear view mirrors, power windows, and power door locks. We've also got two driver memory. Leather wrap top end of the doors with a genuine California walnut wood trim. And inside, we have the light frost beige seats with the perforated inserts, the Overland badging, and the dark frost beige uh, seat piping. Eight-way power driver and passenger seat with four-way adjustable lumbar support. This vehicle is also equipped with a leather wrap, power tilt and telescoping steering wheel with audio controls and California walnut wood trim. Automatic headlamps with fog lamps and remote fuel door release. All right, so we're gonna pan through the interior just a little more detail. On the steering wheel, you have your Uconnect Bluetooth voice command buttons, as well as your trip computer buttons. And on the right-hand side, you have your cruise control, as well as your adaptive cruise. This vehicle currently has 68,671 miles on it. Part of the keyless enter and go, it also has the push button start. You connect 730 with the navigation system. It also has a reverse camera by placing the vehicle in reverse. And has guidance lines. And moving down, you have controls for your dual zone automatic climate control. You've also got your controls for your ventilated seats and your heated seats. And down below, you have your stability control, tow haul mode, heated steering wheel, power point and rear parking sensors power switch. Dual front illuminated cup holders. Select train controller with your four wheel drive low mode, hill descent control, and your quadra lift air suspension controller. This vehicle's center console is two levels. The top level is flocked. It also has a USB power point. And you've got lower storage as well. And looking overhead, overhead LED lighting with map lights. You've also got your power lift gate controller, ambient lighting on your dual pane panorama sunroof. This is the glass control. These are the shade controls, Homelink universal garage door opener, and sunglasses holder. 
Also got an automatic dimming rearview mirror with integrated microphones. Another nice feature is on the overlands, the dash top is fully leather stitched. Even the instrument binnacle, and you can see the French seams running the length of the dash. All right, taking a look at the rear seat, the leather top door, the leather stitch door toppers, the California walnut continue in the rear seat as well. Rear seats also have the perforated inserts with the dark frost uh, edge welting. Rear seat does seat three across. It is a 60-40 split folding seat with reclining seat backs. We've also had a fold down center armrest with integrated cup holders. All right, and rear seat passengers also have their own positional air vents with panel distribution. We've also got a 115 volt, 150 watt AC outlet. And rear seat passengers have their own heated seats as well. And to fold the seats is easy, just lift up on the lever at the base of the seat. All right, and this vehicle is equipped with a two-piece rear lift gate. Underneath the chrome trim, there's a membrane switch that'll unlatch the flipper glass portion. And open the conventional lift gate, just lift up on the handle. All right, in the luggage space, very nice and spacious. You have polished stainless steel tread plates amplifier and subwoofer for your premium audio system. We've also got a 12 volt power point, a couple grocery bag hooks. We have a privacy screen. A little storage cubby. We've also got a removable, rechargeable torch. And underneath the floor mat, you do have your full size spare tire with jack and tools and cargo organizers. Alrighty, and to close the lift gate, just simply press the lift gate button on the trim panel. Alrighty, this does conclude our quick walk around look at this 2012 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland. If you have any questions or would like to see this vehicle, please contact our showroom. One of our friendly sales staff will be more than happy to answer any questions that you may have. And as always, Thanks for watching.